Style Inherited, and I'm so excited to be sharing with you guys my first gift guide of the season. Let's get started. The first item is no surprise to anyone who has been following along with me for a little while now, either on Instagram or the blog. It's a chappy wrap, obviously. <laughs> These blankets are so soft, cozy. I love how they're an oversized fit so that you can really curl up um, either with your dogs, with your significant other, and you don't even have to fight for blanket with these because they're such a great size. For some of them here that I love, I folded them up and um, I've had some of these blankets for a couple of years now. They're still just as great as the day I brought them home. Some people say chappy wraps get better with age and I definitely believe that. Chappy wraps are $135, so I understand that's a little bit more than some people might typically spend on a blanket, but just another reason why it's an amazing gift to give because while you might not personally spend that on yourself, um, if you're looking to get someone this year something special, something meaningful, and you're willing to spend a little bit more um, on them, then this is a great gift. All right, moving on to item two on today's gift guide, Barrington Gifts tote bags. I love that you can customize these tote bags completely from the pattern that you go with, the design, where you place your monogram, the color of your monogram, and even the leather that they use for the handles and the detailing. That's all something that you get to choose and make completely your own, which is why it's such a great gift to give because you can really personalize it for that person that you're giving this gift to, and it just makes it so much more special in my opinion. Uh, I absolutely love the design process. It's so much fun to do. So even if you didn't want to design someone a bag, giving someone a gift card to get them their own bag, I think that's even a great idea as well because then you're giving them this experience. It's not just a bag, it's the design process, getting to make it your own, and that's really special in my opinion. So. Here's two of the styles that I absolutely love and I'm currently using all the time. This one here, as you can tell, is huge. It is awesome. I love this for travel. I love this for um, also, you know, this style, I'm probably going to get a more summer pattern for the summertime, but I have been going to the beach a little bit this fall just to get outside and do something. And this is great to be able to throw in a couple beach towels, some snacks, water bottles, some ranger stuff. And yeah, it's just such a great size as you can see huge it also has a zipper on top which I love because that way I can make sure that I'm not like losing anything if I'm using this for travel um, and if I'm at the beach also I don't have to like worry about getting sand in it so this is a St. Charles tote. I don't know if I already said that or not. And I've got the giant monogram on it, my initials HBP. And yes, I've been using this one nonstop. I absolutely love it. This is a great gift option, I think, for college students, someone who just graduated, even high school students also. I used to tote bag when I was in high school. Uh, but now that kids are going back to school, I think this is just such a great option because it's so cute, it's so fun, um, and it's the perfect size for fitting your laptop and your school books in. As you can see, this one's much smaller than the St. Charles. This is a St. Ann tote. And uh, I use one of these, I think, every single day. When I'm running out of the house, I just throw all my stuff in it and um, then I just go, I don't have to worry about it. It really fits everything and then some. Let's talk price point. The St. Charles tote is $220 and the St. Ann tote is $180. Remember, you get to completely customize these however you want and they are such high quality bags. I cannot say that enough. <laughs> okay, let's talk about our third item on our gift guide. It's under $80. It's these L.L. Bean women's moccasin slippers. They actually come in a style also for men. So whether you're looking to buy something for a man or woman in your life, these slippers are it, honestly. <laughs> Truth be told, in high school, I wore these even as regular shoes. Yeah, I wore them to school like all the time. But that's what we did back in high school, right? Anyway, nowadays, I'm just wearing these around my house. And I have also been packing them for when I go on trips lately. I've been throwing them in my St. Charles tote since it fits everything in the kitchen sink. Um, so it's been really nice. Even when I'm away from home, I always feel like I've got a part of home with me. I'm wearing my usual size and these a size seven. They will stretch out a little bit because they're sheepskin. Ranger's a huge fan also apparently. What? I'm not throwing this for you to chew on. No. Anyway, 
great gift, whether you're looking to get something for your mom, yourself, your significant other, sibling, dad, dog toy. I mean, you're, there's no way that you're playing with that right now. No, you never play with my shoes. What are you doing? I'm putting this back and I'm expecting you to leave it. Stop it. Stop it. Go play with your toy. You've got this. You want to play with that? Go get it. Moving on to the fourth item on our gift guide. It is $35 or $60, depending on which size you buy. It's the Santa Maria Novella Rose Water Toner. This stuff smells amazing. And as you guys can see here, the packaging is pretty awesome as well. I just, it's so pretty. I keep this, I don't keep a lot of stuff on my countertop. I like to keep it clear, but I do keep this out there because it's just such pretty packaging. Another reason why I love this is because it works for so many different skin types, whether you're combating anti-aging, acne prone skin, your combo skin or super dry, whatever it is, this rose water toner is still going to work for you. There's so many ways to use this. You can use this after you've washed your face, before you put on your moisturizer. You can use this before you take your makeup on to prep your skin. You can use it just during the day if you want to refresh your skin. Hey Ranger, what's up? Do you want to try this out? Moving on. Number five on the gift guide today is this Capri Blue mini candle. This is extra special to me because my friend from college, Annalise, she actually just recently sent this to me in the mail. So I can vouch that this is a great gift because I just got it as one and I have not stopped lighting this candle since receiving it. I have not lit a single other candle in my house, just this one. It's so nice. I love the scent. I love just looking at this jar. Can you guys see how gorgeous it is? It's even got this like hammered lid. The scent is so nice. It's not overpowering, but it is something that you does greet you when you walk in the room, which I like. I don't like bu like burning a candle and you don't even smell anything. That just like, upsets me. I'm like, okay, what am I doing here? Anyway, this is such a great gift. The mini size is $14. I think if you get the next size up, it's around 30. Once I'm done with this, I'm probably gonna use it to um, store cotton balls in, or I might just even just leave it on my bedside table because it's so pretty. Moving on to item six and six and a half on the gift guide today, my Smeg toaster and kettle. Oh my gosh. These just, this might be silly, but these just bring me so much joy. And I think that's fine to say though, it's true. And that's why I think they'll make such an amazing gift this holiday season, because they'll bring whoever you gift them to so much joy as well. It's so nice to have something sitting on my countertop that I enjoy looking at. It's not an eyesore at all. In fact, I think it makes my kitchen look even nicer. Um, the kettle is $159 and the toaster is $169. So they're a higher price point, definitely. But there's a reason for that. They're not just beautiful appliances. They're really high quality appliances. Anyway, the toaster, this is going to sound silly and people have made fun of me for saying this, but it just does toast really well. I have had other toasters in the past and this one blows them out of the water. Whenever I put my toast in and I take it out, it's always perfectly toasted. So yeah, I, it's definitely worth the money if you're a big toast person. If you want your bagels perfectly toasted, this is the toaster for you. Lastly, before we move on to the next one, I do want to say also that I think like these are such great gifts to get someone because they're not gifts you would buy yourself, especially if you already have a kettle or toaster. These were housewarming gifts, so I didn't have a kettle or my own toaster before moving into this place. But um, think about all those people in your life who already have these appliances and as much as they'd like to upgrade their appliances to these gorgeous ones uh, that will like look nice on your their countertop, um, if the ones that they already have aren't broken, then what really is the point to do so? I totally get that. And that's why getting these as a gift is such a nice treat because you weren't going to go out and spend that money yourself, but then someone gets it for you. How special is that? Um, I think, yeah, definitely top of a lot of people's list this year, especially since we're spending all this time at home, like make your kitchen counter look nice if you're going to be looking at it all day. And let's be honest, as the weather gets cooler, we're spending more time in the kitchen. I'm definitely guilty of that already. <laughs> okay, number seven on the gift guide is a necklace from Auburn Jewelry. I actually know Samantha, the owner of Auburn Jewelry, really well. She just got married. Congratulations, Sam. And her pieces are just so well made. I love them and they're so fun. So this one right here is the XO enamel necklace in gold and 
white enamel. And how fun is this? I've gifted Auburn jewelry pieces to friends and family in the past and they have always loved them. So that's why this obviously deserved a spot in today's gift guide. And um, I do wear my Auburn jewelry necklace, this one right here, quite often. You can also get completely customizable pieces. I'm not sure what her schedule looks like this time of year. She's probably crazy busy, but for my sister's graduation, I got her two custom necklace, enamel necklaces. One was her um, Frisbee Teams logo and the other one was her college um, logo and she wears them every single day. <laughs> no joke. So yes, Auburn jewelry enamel necklaces are the way to go. All right. Is this one one sleeper night now? <laughs> Number eight on my gift guide is this gorgeous charcuterie board from Ren Home. Their boards range from approximately $50 to over $150. So you can definitely find something that fits your price point. On top of that, I've got a 20% off coupon. So use Helen 20, all caps, and I'll put that in the links below just as a reminder. If you guys can tell here, I've got my initial in the top corner. I love how you can customize these boards and it doesn't cost extra. That's just really special. Again, we already talked about this earlier, but I love being able to give someone something that's personalized and they're really well made. Okay, what is next? I think we only have one more thing on my gift guide. I don't know why I just did nine things today instead of 10. Right, Ranger's the last one. <laughs> She's sleeping right now. All right, last item on our gift guide today is this hat from Hat Attack. How cute. Hopefully my hair looks okay right now. This is cashmere and faux fur. It's really soft, not itchy at all. I've already worn it a couple times this year. It's keeping my head so warm when I'm outside and I haven't been outside in some really cold weather. Hat Attack's a local brand out of Brooklyn, New York. So lots of love for this brand here. I also have a code for you guys. I think it's Helen 20, but I'm gonna have to check. So I will put it down in the link below um, once I confirm what that is. That way you guys can get a nice discount when you shop. So thank you so much for tuning in to my first gift guide, guys. I'm going to be doing some more of these. I'll also be putting some gift guides up on the blog as well that are not in video format. Come here, baby girl. Come here, yeah. I know, you just want to do your gift guide. So I'm going to put the products out here. That way you guys can remember all the things we talked about today. Thank you so much for tuning in to our first gift guide video. I hope you guys liked it. See you guys soon. Bye. great gift idea actually <laughs> i'm going to include that one at the bottom 10 is definitely get someone a puppy never a bad idea in my opinion hi everyone it's helen and ranger here we're sharing with you our first gift guide of the season what do you want to say about ranger <laughs> ranger is being very vocal today and i think she just you know i know we don't have any puppy products in this one i'm sorry yours will come later <sighs> anyway <laughs>